April 4th, 2000, or April 4th, April 14th, 4 4 4 14 16. But anyways, anyways, yes. Shout outs to Fire Team. I believe what Wraith was on earlier, Fokker was on earlier, mm -hmm. and of course uh, Miss Nikki holding it down on the on the talent on the commentary tonight. Thank you guys for watching, hanging out with us. Hopefully your week is going good. Hope you guys got some good plans headed for this weekend. We got Street Fighter Five here, at Alamo Draft House, located in Kansas City, Missouri. Beautiful, gorgeous venue to come out, bring your family, take your date out here, have them have a movie, grab some dinner. It's all in the same building. And of course, every Thursday, top in the shop, Street Fighter Five going on upstairs. So, Fire Team and Folk are coming up next. I actually did not know that. Uh, I thought Fire Team won the match with base, so that's interesting that he got knocked into a losers bracket. Yeah. When I looked away, he was he was up a game, but yeah. here we are, losers round uh, three, I believe. Definitely, yeah. This should be interesting. Um Last time these two played at Max Out, uh, Fokro took it over Fire Team. But as we all know, Fire Team not afraid to do his homework to try to you, address. You know, I, I will I will just say this straight up. Uh, since we adopted Fire Team in our OG FGC Ogro fighting game community, there is no bigger demon in all of Kansas City that beats all of us OG FGC guys than Fokro. Like <laughs> free. Every time I think I have Fokro beat, every time I think he's oh this guy's a moron, he keeps jumping in. I got these anti tires. Fokro does like. Like full screen EX headbutt and I die and I'm like damn it Fokra every time so Fokra definitely a demon for all of us definitely beating us up uh, in Street Fighter 4 as well definitely but here we go more. so uh, things you guys are going to want to watch for in this match is getting that V reversal early I mean you want to try to pin down uh, fire or Wraith or Nash as soon as possible Which, he's going to be able to get out you want to pin down who? So. Okay. I need to switch the names real quick guys yeah so Birdie is just this giant walking wall, and Nash is way is way more mobile than Birdie. But let's see, good anti air from Fire Team there. The poker was still just sitting on a nice life lead, and the soda can just all of this screen pollution putting in work for Poker right now, and slowly putting Fire Team in the corner. But here we go, Fire Team pushing Poker to the corner. Yeah, so the, the the that that told the tale of last match. Those ex uh, those ex headbutts really blowing up. And, and Fireteam kind of one of those players. He's got to hold the can. He Ooh, has to hold the can. Definitely, right there. it's there's so nothing obnoxious. Yeah, and that that overhead that Birdie just did right there has a very uh, extended hitbox on it. So it goes a little farther out than what that boot shows. Fireteam in for big damage right here. Going to go ahead and use the meter. Absolutely. I think above any other Street Fighter game in history, you build meters so fast in this game, so it is good to burn your critical art as soon as you can get it. All right, makes up City. Fire Team shifting gears into the aggressive stance here. And Poker gets him off with a sneeze, and good jump to Fire Team. Yes, you, that is a uh, that is still a, uh, a, a a week one deer in headlight situation, so good good stuff to Fire Team. Uh, be able to recognize that. Of course, you can just jab him out of it. Poker taking to the air now, trying to push Fire Team back in the corner. Dolphin dive in. Fire team looking to uh, catch a stray button with that scythe. Ooh, too far away. Definitely. And fire team's gonna opt to get out instead of confirm for damage. Oh my gosh. See, okay. Pixels forward. Foker was there during max out, as you said. They, uh, the, the fire team lost. The, uh oh, scramble situation. Foker looking for that boom. He wants to chain through it. Yep. This is the range right here. Fire team changing the distance. Foker. Puts hands on it, makes up in the corner, Nash out. Overhead and good way to close yeah. that round out for Fire Team, and he has full meter on deck. Both players need to kind of catch their breath, let that scramble situation, let that mental stun build off, or I mean, Definitely. diminish. Boker getting off to his head and goes for a hard read and gets punished by Super for his trouble. Yeah, he already has a mohawk though, so this does less damage to Birdie. Fun <laughs> fact, <laughs> you know. I'm gonna slap you. I'm gonna oh slap you man. Right. It gets a stray, uh, gets a stray moon salt right there. But I mean, we we'll take it. Nice, nice answer. You know that is not a jaguar kick. Oh, oh, okay. all right. Do like skip to my loo right here. And throw you in the earth. Yep. Not quite enough for uh, not quite enough for a plant. Fire team trying to get that zone. We're <laughs> Hidden missiles, baby. Hidden missiles. That to feel the true MVP. Oh! This is what this is what was blowing them up last time. Inside that range was catching the most. I I, I know this is not random because I know Foker is a very solid player. Yeah. But it when you're in that situation, it 
feels random. Mm -hmm. When a player catches you on the dash and hits you, that is a technically an anti-projectile move. On yes. paper, it is an anti-projectile, and he just caught the dash. You're sitting there as a player, you're like, what? What am I supposed to do? I, my, my brand of random doesn't work on this guy, but his brand of random is all up in my face. <laughs> so I, I expect to see a switch to Ryu here. Not seeing, yeah, I expect to see Ryu here. Yeah. <laughs> So, I have a better color. I have the uh, the Super Turbo Ryu, or uh, Hyper Fighting, I, where it's like the white on white headband. Yeah. What were you going to say? I was going to say thanks. I told you the story, but thank you again for having the pink match color, because that is the best match color. The pink <laughs> oh, black. the pink one? It's so good. I had to sit down one night, and like I need to get colors for other characters. But you got the most important one, and, and my heart <laughs> thanks you for that. So... All right, yep, checking early on, so we saw nothing. Classically, Ryu's gonna do hard kick Katsu into a meaty setup. I know Watson has mentioned a couple times when he's on commentary. Um, so the next setup, pay attention to that. Even though in this game, I believe Ryu wants to confirm into DP does more damage. Definitely. Yeah, and to answer your question, I'll just answer in chat. Fire team pushing, uh, trying to keep Birdie in the corner. There's a lot of patience for the players right now. And here we go. Broken needs to do something to get out of there. Yeah, I, I mean, ooh. Unfortunately, that's a, that's a great way of punishing. Like I said, ending the combo on DP is the best thing that Ryu can do in the situation. And Ryu fits sitting on a full stock of super. Got to be very careful. Optimally, Fire Team would like to. He could. All right. I was going to say, optimally, like to keep on there, but Ryu, probably one of the best chip options with critical art on deck in the game yeah. uh, as far as just you got once you start blocking it you gotta hold that unless you have v-trigger on or v, v skill on deck Boker looking for the chain I was gonna say he's looking yeah. for the chain in that range that's where he had uh, made all his money in the previous games that's gonna be about say Foker or can't react to it at that range so it is minus five it's not free like uh, Street Fighter 4 and I mean that's the thing about the birdie matchup it can it can wear on you as a player because birdie doesn't outright kill you. Yeah. He does not have any like big bursting combos outside of V-Trigger, mm -hmm. but what Birdie does is you just you chase him around, and he waddles back and forth, and he's just kicking you in the head. He gets a stray jab, Ooh. gets a stray medium kick. And, stray banana. Yeah, he got potassium on the board, but look, I, he's not doing any big damage. Like, that's just Birdie. Yeah, he's just this big lumbering wall. That's yeah. all Birdie is. And, and Foker doing a very good job at threatening the space that Ryu wants to dash in and apply oh. pressure. Oh, he had the frame Here stop right go. there, not sure in time. Drops a combo. I feel like that. Ah. Uh, the poker special, baby. Uh, that is poker special. The head butt. All right, poker on match point. Definitely. Fire team looking to. Uh, Try to stay alive here. He has gotta find something. He almost has full meter, and there you go. Excellent use of them. Um, poker sneezes to get fire team off him, and the free Willy. Oh, just Here we go. Oh, okay. Okay. 30, min 30 minutes? Yeah, he said, yeah. So, Poker throwing fire team in the corner. Smart choice. Both players about even on health, but that meter advantage for fire team is pretty huge right now. Man, I wish I wish Whiff's V reversal was punishable, man. I just feel like, come on. Pixels outside of the range for that chain. Yeah. And Foker's still looking for, wow, finds a straight throw. Fireteam's got to recover from that. That's more mental damage than the actual oh, game. Oh, that could have been huge for Fireteam, and he dropped he, it. He was too far away. That second jab was so oh, far away, he got it. This, this is, is big it. damage. Goes for, is that good to Scale down, going to be enough. So, the real right. pick looking like it's working out for Fireteam. Yeah, so on the other side of this coin, uh, Fireteam, or Fokra, Dabble, he main Geef in every other Street Fighter known to man. Uh, dabbled a little bit in Street Fighter Five, but so we're not going to see character select right back into it. Yeah. So the thing to work, the, the the thing that tells the tale is, will Folk find that magic range where the like the pixel perfect chains are right now getting mauled? Frame traps, jabs to catch it up, B reversal. That, that is the exact right answer. For Fire Team, right back in with that long sweep. Wow, man. No, I would like to see Fire Team try to like uh, when he. When people V reversal off jump ins, that's a free throw opportunity for the aggressor. Right, right, right. But Fire it, Team is not taking advantage of it. It's that. weird to react to because in your mind you go, oh, this is an attack I need to block, but you just want to throw it. You just yeah. want to throw it. So Fire Team, all of a sudden, despite all the talk, throwing good side of the right now. 
Yeah, he is he is in brawler mode Ryu. Ooh. Crush counter, excellent conversion. Can on the board. Yeah, neutral jump is definitely the tool in his in his arsenal right now doing work. I, I guarantee you, if that chain would have hit fire team, it would have been GG's. Yeah. The whole whole set would have been done. <laughs> but here we go. Fire team at a severe life disadvantage right now. Both players are full super, but Fire Team also has this beast trigger on board, and here we go. Yep. Keep it simple, keep it simple. Folk are gonna try to use this meter probably to EX through it just like that. Cancel with the trigger. It's gonna say people people have been starting to use that. I say people, birdie players starting to use EX uh, headbutt, like Balrog's EX dash, punish that, please. Super Whoa! Oh, oh no. Uh, he wanted super earlier. Like yeah. and look at Fokra. Charging down the Nana. pike here, potassium Overhead. on the board. Look how far away it hit. Nice, nifted out. Dan is gone. Oh, yeah, you good cannot. From I have, Birdie might have one of the best normal anti-airs in the game. Definitely. I have a crouch medium punch, I believe, the little headbutt. Yeah. It's so good and it stops so much. Fire team going back to more of a zone game right here. Yep, Fokker challenging with the chain. Excellent. Neutral nope. jump, big damage. Yeah, good. And from fire team. Yep, excellent range right there. No, he was too far away to confirm that uh, Crouch Fierce. EX Chain versus EX Hotto. Good tech. Let's Definitely want to try to apply this kind of pressure to Birdie. Like, even though he does have on the surface, he yes, he is a quote-unquote grappler. You want to throw him. You want to grapple him. You want to get up in his grill. Nobody's mashing out SPD in this game. Oh, misses an anti-opportunity. You saw the stand medium punch. I believe that was yeah. e uh, DP easy in the corner. Looking for fireballs right here. Who was going to blink first? Excellent defense by Foker, hanging yeah, on. Just waiting. Foker can be very patient when he needs to be. And it's playing off right now. Yeah, you got a big resource right now, and that is the clock. Still 45 seconds to play. Both players, you know, who's going to slow down? Who's going to go to neutral first and be able to react? That is, oh, oh my goodness. No punish? No answer, though. See, there's that throw. There's yes. the throw I was talking about. Good stuff to fire, team. Ryu on, on V trigger, going to look for a sweep and a cancel here. 31 yeah. seconds to play. Oh, big damage opportunity. Go. This is going to be it. Not going to be enough to kill. Shin Shoryuken. Excellent answer. Ah, good wow. stuff to Fire Team. Closing that out. Smart pick with the re That was a great, like. great set. Yeah. Great set between both guys. So, Fire Team getting a little bit of revenge from Max Out, as you mentioned, but, uh, you know, like I said, that match can go either way with those guys. Definitely. Uh, Fire Team, stay on. I need Fire Team and Nick one time. Watson will play the winner of this. No, sorry. Base and Chadwick up on stream next. Base and Chadwick. All right, guys. Again, thank you so much for watching Top in the Shop this evening here at Alamo Draft House. They have been hosting us now since December. Definitely. And if you are in the I-70 area, Odessa, I don't know, shit, even Lexington, Odessa, Oak Grove, Grain Valley, Blue Springs, Independence, Raytown, Kansas City, further on than that, Warrensburg. and you want to play fighting games, there is no reason you cannot come out here. Uh, we are in, I believe, week eight or week week six or one of those in between. We're six and eight yeah, of the there. game being out. So, still plenty of opportunity to get out here, get on the ground floor of this fighting game. I know it's when a fighting game's been around for a while. It's kind of it can be very intimidating. Yeah. Like, oh, I'm getting the scene. I'm brand new, and all these guys have been playing forever. Uh, still plenty of time to uh, to get that figured out. So please come out. Learn Street Fighter with all of us. Get better with Kansas City. Make the Midwest uh, a force to be reckoned with. St. Louis is playing really hard. And uh, on that note, Max out uh, May 9th. Kansas City's longest running regional fighting game tournament. I try, I'm trying to figure out what, what uh, Nick's name was. Uh, get there yeah, it's one, just get there one time. time. It's and actually it's number one at that matter. Oh, is it? Yeah. What a heathen. You don't, you don't put a number like that. All the AP style be damned. F uh, Nash versus Bison. Look at this cream color Bison. I like this. The creamiest Bison. Indeed. Now we got boots. Battle of the boots. Military boots versus dictator boots. Yeah, this is like this is like what Bison would wear like in the middle if he was doing like a Middle East campaign or something. But anyways, <laughs> cannon aside, Ooh. Nash Bison. And yeah. fire team after Sight. a really Sight. strong start right here. Oh wow, uh, Nick had time to mash out of that. The, the bird dizzy is very short. Like, you can, if you crush on your stick, you will get out of that. This is how wait, you control bison. Wait, wait, wait. Are the dizzies different depending on what dizzy? Yes. I never yes. realized that. Yeah, dizzy, uh, the, the birds is the lowest. And then I believe Stars it's. Highest? I, 
Oh no, wait, skulls is probably skulls. High. Skulls is the high or the little the little death that yeah. little the little um. Uh, the, the, the Grim Reapers. Yeah, the little Grim Reapers. Yeah, thank you. The little ghost that floated on your head. That's the highest stun. Okay. Like, you're not getting out of that. You're dead. So it goes from highest to lowest. You got Grim Reapers to stars to birds? Yeah, I, I don't actually... Is stars in this game? I thought it was only the the, the chicks and the... Uh, Grim Reapers? Yeah, the Grim I Reapers. Don't. I've only ever seen those. Okay. I never realized that. Like, yeah. like what, is there anything that determines it? Or is it just random? Yeah, yeah. So, like, if you have a thousand stun and you get a thousand one, you get the the chicks, right? Okay. But if it's like a thousand five hundred, then you get the Three, death. Okay. So, oh, okay. Yeah, it's, it's the difference between That's my combo did 99 stun and the next hit did four, you know, 50 stun That's and now they now they have skulls instead of dizzing into the jab. Anyway, Bison going to work, Kool-Aid on the board. Nice frame traps right there. Get, uh, get there one time is, is very, very good at abusing these big boss buttons. I don't know why the... Fire Team was trying to push plus buttons after EX. Uh, Shit, I didn't picks. see that dizzy. I didn't yeah. see what kind of dizzy I that was. I think that was the. Was well, that Reaper. stars? That was Grim Reaper. Oh, okay. Ooh, yeah, and, and Bi Bison, I mean, he is the boss character. So yes. all of his buttons are big, meaty, they're mean, they just beat you up. Look at that, chasing him down. This is how he walks, like his arms crossed, like you are oh, yeah. so beneath me. Yeah, dude, dictator. I, I really, I'm really uh, hyped for the the story mode. Like, what's what's what is Bison doing? Oh, misses an anti right there. What's the hard kick version? Yeah. Uh, Nash has three different versions of the scythe. Light kick, medium kick, or the horizontal covering, and the hard kick one is the anti air. But it is not a DP, so you have to be good at it. It is not. It is not as simple as a DP. Get there one time now, just bullying Nash, trying to push him into the corner. Nash loses to most meaty pressure, and Nick knows that excellent anti on the devil's reverse. Got to deal with this. Ooh, but uh -oh. no, I confirmed. Yeah, both sides on that coin were kind of a little like, oh, is he blocking the fireball? And then fire team got hit. It really wasn't, you know, how did he get hit by that? There's a lot of respect from both players right now. Both yep. beat trigger on deck. Ooh, and this is huge. Yeah, that's, that's gonna, gonna be super. It. Yeah. Yep. Cut the hat. Cutting the hat in half. All right, fire team on the board. Yes. Fire team, uh, you know, I, I know I saw I see cups in there. He uh, said that fire team was looking a little off tonight, and I agree. He looks a little tired, but I think that match right there was uh, he got woken up a little bit. Mm -hmm. uh, that last match with Foker kind of knocked out the uh, the cobwebs. Definitely, and that can kind of happen. Like you know, I talk about this is still a new game. Fire team going back and forth between Ryu and Nash. That might be, you know, playing a little bit that. But Fire team's execution monster, so no surprise he's able to wake up. Here comes Nick one time. Uh, interesting choice not to push a button after scissor kicks. That's what you want to watch for for Bison players. You block that scissor kick, and you gotta watch the button that comes after. Well, the thing is, if unless it's EX, scissor kicks is not plus. Right. So. But like, oh my a lot goodness. of patience from Nick one time, but Fire team just content to just keep Nick one time in the corner. And here, all right, those go. are birds. Yes. Ooh. Yep. Not enemy enough to kill. I need one more mix-up. So, uh, one of the ways that people are looking at Bison now in this game is, mm -hmm. if you're going to play Bison at a high level, you have to dedicate yourself to Bison, and then you have to dedicate yourself to V skill or V trigger Bison. Yes. And on the opposite side of that, you have to know how to fight both. They're, they're both very different characters. It's yes. like playing two characters in one, almost like a Gen Stance Switch. Mm -hmm. So uh, I would like to kind of see maybe Bison activate that. That being said, Get yeah. There is a proficient bass player. I am not. And right now... Uh, right now, Fire Team looking really comfortable. But yeah. close out the set. Like right now, activate V trigger. Uh, and you know, I only say that pertaining to this matchup, Fire Team hasn't really been a pressure monster yet. So there's really no reason to hang on to all of this V trigger. Definitely. You know, obviously you want to confirm into it, but you gotta take advantage of it somewhere. Don't don't leave your money on the a table. Of, a lot of bison just try to look for safe off periods to activate V trigger and Nick Portem hasn't had that opportunity yet. I mean yeah, he can just slide and V trigger. There we go. Oh slide V yeah, trigger. Are you serious right now? Uh, oh my goodness, what side? Okay, fire team in the corner, but full beast trigger on deck. Plus. Overhead, gonna say hello. Patience right now for both players. Dead. Good stuff from fire team to close that, that set. Yep. So. All right, fire team will advance. Still not out of it yet. Mm -hmm. He will play Watson Chan here in a little bit. If you guys want to follow along at home, please hit that exclamation point bracket. You will be notified 
real time. So, I need Bass and Chadwick on stream. Bass and Chadwick. My condolences in stream. We are back to see a Lord. How's the bracket looking? Uh, we're here. Two, four, six, eight. So. So. All the all the setups are open for casuals now, guys. We are going to see lots of grabs. Lots and lots of grabs. In case you missed, uh, in case you missed us from earlier. Where grabs. is Chad? That is a good question, actually. Where is Mr. Billionaire Boys Club? I don't see. All right, guys, well, uh, I did mention that this is both a restaurant and a theater at the same time, so guys enjoying drinks, guys enjoying okay. food, so going off to a bathroom break is where Mr. Chad, I believe, is. Yeah. Um, so we're going to take a quick break. Don't go anywhere. We've got uh, Losers Round 4 coming up. So we're going to go, if you guys are looking at the bracket at home, uh, we're going to go the rest of Losers Bracket all the way up to Losers Finals. So we have Bass versus Chadwick coming up next, followed by Watson, Chan, and Fireteam. And then we will play our Losers Final match, and then we'll jump back up to Winner's Side and run our Winner's Finals, and then Losers Finals, and then Grand Finals. Try to do that to try to so that the winner can stay playing and not Okay, you did your winner's finals match. Now go sit for, you know, 45 minutes while we play the rest of the losers. Yeah. Uh, usually, usually we don't have enough setups for the uh, guys in the winner side to stay warmed up. But uh, tonight, everybody brought a setup out tonight. Yeah. In fact, we had, we had more setups than we had players. So <laughs> kudos to the community, keeping it going. Of course, this is not done by one guy. It takes a community to build a scene and keep it going. Definitely. So... So again, I uh, want to give a special thanks to uh, Miss Nikki on commentary tonight, Watson Chan, Fire Team, Wraith was on here for a little bit, I just saw him run a stream off, Poker was on here, uh, so those guys... Uh, and special thanks to Robbie for running the stream! <laughs> It's about all. It's about all I can do right now. I cannot find my feet in this game right now, and it's frustrating me because I'm I'm actually the best Street Fighter player in in this state. Like, yeah. <laughs> but you want me to say that? I'm just gonna. I'm just. You don't have to say anything. You just have to be like, yeah, you're right. You're right. I just, I just nod in my head. <laughs> no, I wish we would have had this kind of crowd last year for Street Fighter Four. Yeah. So here comes Chad, the bum himself. <laughs> Chad and Bass on stream, please. Yeah, no, he's not. Nice try, Sensei guy. So. Money match you right this second. Come find me in Club Penguin. I don't know. I, that's like the first thing that popped in my head of like online games or whatever to do. Nah, Keep cups. me in Dark Souls 3, baby. That's where I've been playing like the last week. I, I, need, to, I need to play more of it. I haven't really practiced any Street Fighter 5 this week, unfortunately. Uh, like, with, with Faith being at my place, it's like I got it, and then it's like, oh, hey, I have a guest over for the next week and a half. Uh, you play the other Dark Souls games? Yes. Good. I've played every. I played. Started with the original Demon Souls, and um, yeah. then Dark Souls happened, and. I actually never beat Dark Souls 2 because my PS3 that had my save file yellow lighted on me. Mm. So I've actually never beaten that game, but the thing is, Dark Souls 2 is definitely like just overall the weakest Souls game. Man. Bloodborne was fantastic though. I did like Bloodborne. I, I I got on late in the Dark Souls train, so like it was on sale for seven dollars on Steam. Picked uh -huh. it up, played through it, loved it. Number two, you mean? Uh, hey, ba base, are you red? Base, are you red? Are you red? So, oh shit, not base, base with a C. Um, quick thing, um, so Dark Souls 2 was your first Dark Souls? Uh, so I, no, Dark Souls 1, I beat, played all the way through oh, yeah, three Dark times Souls. in a row, like back to back to back, new game, and then Dark Souls 2 played it all the way through multiple times, yeah. and just in time for Dark Souls 3. Wow, look at the, uh, I don't know, is that a Laura thing where like both players back up full screen and do the fully this, charged lightning? This is lightning? gonna be, who can make who explode first? I still say, and base proving my point, who can anti-air? Because yes. I, I, Laura is a character I think Ooh. is most suspect. Oh, okay, there is stars. Yes. All right, so I'm gonna Google that and see what what the uh, stars mean. What 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 the what the bigger one is? I know for a fact that you know the Rim Reapers are the highest, but uh -huh. uh, I don't know what I don't know if it's. I feel like I see chicks more than stars, so I think yeah. chicks, stars, skulls. I think is what it yeah. is. Um, but Laura, I think, is the most 
suspect character to jumping around in this game. Mika second and then Birdie third. Far away. Here we go though. That yep. stun is building up. And one more. Wow, hit. not quite enough. Okay, but that here was. Here we go. This smash out of that. That was a really fast first game. Yep. Goes to base. Um, oh my god, that was game one already, huh? Yes! I thought it was like a 1-1 well, like one -one side. Aura just happened, okay? That's what this character does. She, once you get in, if you do not know how to defend against her, you explode. Just... I'm gonna... Boom! Looks like That's how select. you start the round and finish it quickly. That, yeah, okay. boom, baby. Uh, Alex, or Chad, yeah. can play Alex. He is a third strike Alex player exclusively. There it is. I would. I don't agree with this. I actually do not in agree the, with this. In the mirror know. match, go for it. I saw him playing Ken earlier. I, I don't know. Ken. I've not seen this Ken. This is going to... Let's see what happens. I think he wants the DP. I think that's why he's going for this, but we'll see if it pays off for him. Yeah, no. Uh, the, having the DP is right because, like I just said, Laura, one of the most suspect characters in this game for jumping, you need a solid anti-air. Yeah, and that DP definitely served Fireteam well. It served Axiom well. Let's yep. see if it serves Chadwick similarly. So, buttons you want to look for in this game on Ken, like I said, uh, the fireball not going to be super great. You have to be very careful with the Lion Breaker co uh, target combo. That is the, the medium kicks you keep seeing come out. And once Laura gets in, I mean, it works good for Ken because Ken also wants to be point blank. Oh, medium kick Tatsu, got to punish that. Uh-oh, a little bit of perhaps match unfamiliarity. That being said, that could be a relic of the previous game where Tatsus were either all even or pretty much safe. Yeah. Wow, he is really trying to guess with the medium kicks. Ooh. Oh my gosh, barely dodges that anti-air. Full v, uh, v trigger on deck. Ken, one of the strongest characters in the game with it active as far as burst damage goes. And really, Ken kind of wants to take this matchup like he does Mika. Use your V6 skill, get them off of you, like keep them out, because like, you can still zone. And Laura will jump. Laura will jump, I promise you. Every MF or jump. Yeah, Shadow Peace makes something happen soon. And oh no. One chance, and it gets clipped by the overhead. Yeah. This, the Ken pick not really showing any promise yet, but it, he did last longer at least, so that's. Maybe he can take more advantage of that this game. Yeah, I need to see some zoning here. Excellent anti by base. Wake up jabs. Uh, I am really scared of Laura's meaty pressure, probably more than any other character this entire game. Yeah. The stand roundhouse is Her so good. Her reward off is just ridiculous. Yeah. Oh. Another thing to point out here, base. So think about this. If you don't jump, if, if you don't anti-air somebody's jump and they're in for free, right? Definitely. The jumping in this game is now a dash. So if you're not, you have to realize the only way this player is getting in on me is the dash. you got to fight the dash. There are, there are no safe dashes. You hit them on the way in, slow the pressure down. Mm -hmm. Bates is being really patient right now. Chadwick needs to make something happen this is, soon. That should be. That should have been dead. That shoulder would have been dead. And oh my gosh! Finds the, the overhead. All right. Yeah. So base can uh, take it. Uh, we've got Watson Chan and Fire Team on stream, please. Mm -hmm. All right. I'm going to pass the mic off to. Do you want to? I'm going to pass the mic off to Mr. Wraith, guys. Thank you so much Mr. for watching Wraith. Top in the Shop for uh, April 14th, 2016 here at Alamo Draft House. Nice. Practice that commentary. Hi. How are you? I'm doing all right. I'm in Winners Finals. I'm pretty pretty happy. Pretty, pretty, <laughs> how do you feel about fighting uh, Axiom? I have no idea. That's fair. We have the most back and forth record. Yeah. ever in the history of video games. But here's my question. Can you get the Dark Axiom to rise? Oh, that would be easy. I'm not going to, but I definitely could. <laughs> oh, yeah. I promise you uh, that. Seeing that ha almost happen at a case at a Kansas City Onslaught, that was... I was just trying to make like, oh, man. Oh, man. It's about... This man's about to light up. Well, the thing is, not a lot of people will talk back to Axiom when he starts getting fired up. Yeah. I, I'm not... A, I won't... I will, though. I uh, I don't let him do that because it's all a it's all a mental game. He, he, he doesn't dislike anybody, and he's not super salty as he sounds. He just wants to get in your head. So uh, you just gotta protect yourself from that. Don't let him do that. Don't let anyone do that. Yeah. Don't let guilty do that. Don't let anyone. Nobody. Don't let Nikki do that. I don't even know anything. I'm I'm, <laughs> I'm a nice person. Oh my God, Gimli versus. <laughs> Uh, what's Fire Team's Aragorn? MMO name? <laughs> um, um, he he's definitely sage like. He would be for for him being like the youngest dude in the scene. He is like an elderly sage man. Is he really that young? 
He's super young. He's like what? Twenty? Yeah, he's uh, twenty. He's like twenty one in December, I think. Huh. Yeah. Well he he's a young man. Huh. He's got that fresh spongy learning brain. Though them them young reactions. Mm -hmm. Whew. Fire team's scary, man. Yeah. And then he'll smile at you. Like good game. You you tried really hard, dude. <laughs> Fuck you, fire team. <laughs> What's the time he just complains about? Yeah, Rayshon, you are, you are a super baby. Most of the time I play for him, he just complains about cash. So yeah, well, if you like beat him, for sure. But if he beats you, he's he's just like the happiest person. And he makes you feel good for losing. I, I, I yeah. guess. Blech. <laughs> but let's see what happens. Um, <coughs> I don't think I've yeah. to play in five. It um, looks like Watson has completely um, stopped playing Chun in tournament, at least yeah. for this tournament. Looks like he's pretty happy with his choice of. Uh, oh my fears. God, that that is such a silly anti-air. Poor fierce. <laughs> Definitely. You see, you see people anti-airing with Nash in the weirdest ways. Bazooka knee, forward fierce. Oh, Bazooka knee is actually really, really good. Yeah, it's super good. It's like a it's long fast. range anti-air. Man, Here that was a quick round. Oh, it's I like that little yet. setup. That's cool. Little. Uh, Ooh. Frame Watson, kill Watson's slash kill. Not out of the state. He has a chance. Gets beat to here. Nice. That is the way to deal with uh, V triggers. Yes. V reversals. Just a lot of feelings out there. Neutral and good crouching uh, jab to close it out for fire team. Yep. That's the uh, Japanese chip out. Jab, 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 jab. Ooh. That moonsault. And here we oh, go. Crush counter. Oh. Uh, I don't agree with that combo at he, all. I think he just wants to um, save his. Neither? No, he's no, he really still could have gotten a much better combo with the same positioning and much better damage. Oh, there it is. And here we go. There's that damage. Come on, there we go. We're rest. going down to 15%. Nope. 20. 20%? Okay. I don't know. Now and we're... He's almost dead. That's yeah. all that matters. Chip, chip, overhead, chip. Perfect. Watch your toe. Perfect. Watch your toe. You're so? Uh, Charlie is freaking undead. Okay. And he's wearing a watch. And he has like fake he needs to tell time. No, he's immortal. Is, he not only has a watch, he has fake glasses on. Fake? Yeah, those are no. fake glasses. They've always been fake. Like if you go to buy Charlie's alt costume in the store for their story mode, he's like, and caught like the dance comment. He's like, he's been wearing these fake glasses since Alpha. Why is he still wearing them? Why are they fake? Because he's just a cool. He's trying to be a cool dude. He's like, yeah. look at me. I'm ed edgy. He really does look like he's trying a little too hard. I mean, look at those cut no, 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 no. that cut off vest. Who wears a cutoff vest with a midriff? Not only is he trying to hard, that? he tried so hard and he that got so, so far, sad. but in the end it doesn't even matter because that's his favorite band, I'm sure. But now, <laughs> see how he looks. Linkin Park. Yeah, yeah dude, he, he, looks? he is He is in the 90s right now. Straight from the 90s. Cargo pants, vest. Anyways, man. Fire team is just a wall right now against Watson. While all the balls get thrown. Oh, good. Good meaty from Watson. And has the corner. But fire team has V trigger on deck. All right, he got out. He's got uh, still a good amount of life. Mm -hmm. Lots of lots of little shimmies here from fire team. Mm -hmm. Looks like he's trying to get a, most of his damage from this medium punch. Yeah, Watson has gotten a lot of like you said earlier. He's getting lots of damage from this squeeze, but we haven't seen much of that here because fire no. team's just spacing has been really on point. What's uh, Nash's punish for sweep? Does he um, only get crouch medium kick? I like crouch basically. medium kick into uh, Sonic. I guess he can counter sweep, crouch medium kick. So Max range at least. Oh no, confirm. Sweep. Oh, there you go. There's now, the one. That's the sweep that. And I don't agree with that meter. You double edged sword. He could have just ended it with the light Sonic slice. Right. But, but that is that is a little bit harder to hit. So oh at least that. Still, you know. Just, just, yes, anyways. definitely waste the meter. But it's alright, because he's Ooh, Nash and he's got a full meter and he's yeah, again. Full sticks of butter on yeah. deck. Ooh, he's cornering himself. Doesn't have a V-trigger right now. Watson Ooh. needs to make something happen, but he lets him out yeah, with a moonsault. This is looking pretty one-sided right now. Fire team looking really dominating. Watson checks he wants him to corner jump. and gets into air for his attempt. Video clip was saved. Um, oh, 
Fire Team's such a good player, man. Like, uh -oh. you always know what he's looking for, but you can't really stop him. There we go. Watson Chan has a chance. No, he's has gonna. In the that was a weird forward heavy kick or stand heavy kick. Oh. Tricky. Tried to close it out. Some shenanigans. Yeah. Watson. I don't agree with Watson Chan doing the hey, fireball. Stay safe. Though, because he needs to you better be crouch chance. blocking. He's gonna. Ah, gets the boot to the chest. Yeah, it was pretty one sided, but. Um, it looks like Watson was getting some intel as it was going on. It's not enough. Fire team's too solid, man. Definitely. So, 